best way to learn Photoshop is to get your hands in there and get your hand on the mouse and your hand on the keyboard and do the things that you're seeing in the videos. Hey ladies and gentlemen, my name is Rob Schwartz from Brain Buffet and uh, really quick just wanted to give you a super quick introduction to what we're doing here. So this is the Photoshop set of tutorials and uh, just to give you a really quick introduction to our way of doing things, everything is really project based, it's hands on. So you need to be going along in the software. Watch the video, I'll show you a couple things and then you should be doing the exact same thing in the software. If you just watch them, Without doing them in the software, it will not stick. So here we can see we've got a girl with a backpack taking a picture. She's in my shot, so I'm gonna just brush right over her with that tool, and when I let go, I'm telling you, sometimes I, they come out with a new tool. This did not used to be here when I started with Photoshop. And I'm going to raise the opacity and drop down the scale to... Now what I wanna do with that selection loaded, I'm going to create a mask by clicking on this icon right here. Okay, I'm just telling you from years and years of experience and understanding the elements and principles and really getting into it and experimenting it is what sets somebody apart from like a newbie and being just a rock star at Photoshop. Here, the tracking, which controls the space between all of the characters in my selected text more shapes. We've got these splatters and stuff like that. In computers, we use what's called additive color. You'll enjoy art so much more. 